Jed here to demonstrate how to manage your contacts in the GoTo Desktop app. In addition to showing you where to find your company contacts, I'll show you how to add others. I'll also demonstrate how to quickly start a call, meeting, or message session with a contact. I'll be using the Desktop app for this video. However, the web experience of GoTo can be accessed at this site. I've already signed in as the user Lance Bingham, and this is the homepage. Before I begin, you may have different icons here depending on what options are available with your GoTo plan. Click the Contacts icon. This is the main contacts page. Let's talk about the options you see here on the left side. Here are your favorites. These are contacts you designate always to be shown in this area. They can be internal or external contacts. I'll show you how to create favorites in a moment. Here's a list of the contacts that you've communicated with recently. This list also consists of internal and external contacts. Click the Show More option to see even more contacts. If you still do not see the person you are looking for, use the search option. You can search by name, extension number, and email address. When names are shown, you can either click on them to be taken to their main contact page or hover over them for additional options. Depending on whether the contact is internal or external and their online status, you'll see different one-click options for starting a phone conversation, chat session, or meeting experience with them. I'll talk more about why specific options are available and others are not in a moment. I've clicked on an internal contact. When referring to internal contacts, it is essential to note that their information cannot be edited, nor can the contact be deleted. Let's talk about three ways you can potentially communicate with a contact. If your contact has a valid phone number or an internal extension, the call option works. If your contact has more than one phone number, you'll need to specify which one to dial before the call is placed. The message option can work for internal chat communication. If your contact has a valid phone number and you have a direct phone number assigned to you, you can then text external contacts with this option. To use a text option, however, that setting must be enabled for your phone number in the administration portal. The meet option starts a video meeting. This is available for internal contacts or contacts with the GoTo account. This icon determines if the contact is a favorite or not. For example, if the star is solid, they are a favorite, and white stars are not. That status can be changed as often as needed. Let's talk about adding a new contact. Click the Add Contact button near the search field. Here is where you can provide information for a contact. Under the Personal Details section, you can add things like their name, birthday, and company to name a few. In the contact information section, you can add phone numbers, email addresses, and physical addresses. If you want to add more than one entry to these fields, click the respective add option. You may have noticed that there is no option anywhere to upload a picture of the contact. That is something you cannot do. Individual users will need to upload an image to their GoTo account. Be sure to click Save when you're done. We can now easily see all of the information we just entered. If you need to add, delete, or correct any information, click the Edit Contact button. You can now make the necessary corrections and be sure to click Save when you're done. Take note of the Delete Contact button. If you click that, it will remove any contact information that you've added for them. However, it will not stop them from being able to call you. When they call back, their phone number will be shown. It should also be noted that you cannot delete internal contacts. That's all there is to manage your contacts in the GoTo Desktop app.